Fear is like an unpredictable sea. At times you can tame it, yet other times. It leads you right into the heart of the storm. Helen, the wife of the King of Sparta, Menelaus, was kidnapped. The princes of Troy, who violated the sacred principle of hospitality, are at fault. The storm they unleashed was soon to sweep through the whole of Greece. With wind in their sails, to the beat of the war drums, the sons of Greece set sail, hungry for justice and glory, ready to restore honor and to punish the bold Trojans. And among them, Achilles, a fearless warrior whose mere presence filled hearts with courage. A hero of a hundred battles. But this time, even he did not believe in an easy victory. The Trojans made sure of that. A fiery blaze illuminated the night sky, bringing death and destruction. Fear looked the Greeks in the eyes. Trapped in the unrelenting grip of the elements, they had to overcome their fright. Suddenly, one of the boats broke free from the hellish turmoil. Achilles, with Myrmidons at his side, fought his way to the shore. If only he could recapture Helen, the war would be at its end. At least that's what he still believed back then. My brothers in arms, we did not fight through the storm and flames to perish in this wretched sun. We have come here to win, and we shall win when we recapture Helen from the enemy's grasp. Many armies have fallen before these walls. Look for their weak points and capacity. That is how we shall try to get inside. Cast away your fear and fight bravely, and when the battle's dust settles, the glory of true heroes shall await you. To Troy! I need to get to Troy and rescue Helen. That is the only way to die, you quickly. Greek scoundrel! the Trojans' attention, it will give my men time to find a passage inside. I will challenge their commander, and if he is in his right mind, maybe I could convince him to give up Helen. I just need to get to the gate. Die, you Greek scoundrel! You must be a fool to come here alone. Is it death you seek, Achilles? Or maybe you want to beg for mercy? Hector, I suggest an honest duel. The victor shall decide Helen's fate and put this war to an end. 
Helen is under Paris' protection. Are you and your brother ready to sacrifice the lives of your men for her? When the rest of the fleet gets here, hundreds will die on both sides. Why must anyone else die when the commanders can put an end to further bloodshed with one duel? You seek an honorable solution? But there is nothing honorable about war. It's messy and brutal, and history is written by the victors. Archers! On my mark! History is indeed written by the victors, but your death was not in vain. It will help end this hopeless war. Hopefully the gate will not budge. Surely I won't get inside this way. I'll fight you until the end! Commander! I have found a way to the city not far from here, in a rock cleft. Son of a bitch ambushed me. Your sacrifice shall save thousands. After the battle, we will raise our cups in your name. Rest in peace, soldier. Your deeds shall never be forgotten. I think I found the passage. This will have to do. The defenders prepared for a frontal attack, but they did not consider this narrow passage. An entire army would not be able to get through it. But a small unit would slip through and divert attention. Alright, I'm in. I have to find the way into the upper city. That's where I shall find the help. Don't kill me! 
Help me! One more Kill wretched dog has slipped inside. Stop him! The enemy is running to us in Paris! Soldiers, protect the prince! Protect Prince Paris! Enough of this madness, Paris! Release Helen! Madness? Look beyond the walls. There you will witness true madness. The madness of the kings who came here with you! This war is nothing but the consequences of your mindless decisions. You have stained the honor of the king of Sparta. The honor of the Greeks! Did you think that this insult would go unpunished? You think that if Helen returned to Greece, it would change anything? You speak so much of Menelaus, yet you failed to see who wanted this war from the very beginning. Besides, if I handed Helen over to that sick tyrant, it would be like sentencing her to death. I came to love her, and I shall defend her until my last breath. Helen knows the the truth of this entire world is built on a lie. No, this cannot end like this. I thought I was a step away, a step away from ending this war. Doubt, however, struck first. Unexpectedly, it overpowered me. I could feel my strength waning with each moment, and the cold grip of fear taking away my will to fight. Before I regained my composure, I was in the clutches of the abyss. Time and space lost meaning, until finally, that voice appeared inside my head. Doesn't make any sense. Where am I? 
How did I get here? I can't be far from Troy. I need to take a look around. See any Trojans around? Trojans? I don't recall ever stumbling upon them in these lands. And I have lived here for a very long time. I take care of local necropolises and those who rest within them. People used to pay proper respect to the dead. These shrines, too, they sought strength and solace within them to face the challenges ahead. You should try doing that, too. Reflecting upon one's life can bring meaning to one's death. You look tired and lost. Can I help you somehow? Show me the way to the walls of Troy. I must get there as quickly as possible. With the winds on your side, you will have to sail for a couple of days to reach the walls of Troy. Or rather, to what's left of them. Ten years ago, Agamemnon and Menelaus attacked Troy causing fear and bloodshed to spread all over Greece. They arrived here too, in Mycenae. No, that's impossible. You're lying. I am not in the habit of lying to others. I try to help them. Tough times we live in, and mutual aid is now a very precious and rare currency. If I'm not mistaken, somewhere here lives a very skilled smith. He remembers the times of war. I'm certain he will help you find your way in this very difficult moment. He can also take care of your equipment because, as far as I can see, it seems to be past its prime. Thanks for the advice. If you really don't remember the last couple of years, Greece may seem different to you, foreign and you might not recognize your old friends. Send them back where they belong.
Something's blocking the passage. insane. Why would I have to do this? Why am I am I seeing? I don't have much choice.
life power is growing.
Would you look at that? <laughs> Bold of you to show up in Myrmidon armor. I remember skinning the last one of them years ago. <laughs> Seems I was wrong. One more traitor still breathing. <laughs> Seize him, boys, but don't damage his armor. Menelaus will shower us with gold for it. Get him! <laughs> don't kill me! <laughs> Menelaus' soldiers would not touch a Myrmidon. Traitor? What was that marauder on about? Yeah! <laughs> 
someone's looking for trouble.
fast growing. Resentment and anger coming from you, warrior. You, like me, have been marked by loss. You're... dead. How is it possible that I'm talking to you? Don't interrupt me while I'm talking. The souls of my soldiers returned. Lost. Devoid of purpose. A destructive force trapped them around three faces of fear. On a plane not far from here. Please make the souls of my men leave this world once and for all.
Set. On set. You want, but let me live. That wound doesn't look good. What happened to you? Bandits. The damn bandits rob everyone walking down this road. They also got me. There. They have a come in the bush. You're a warrior. Please, you have to stop them. I'll make sure they pay for this.
Have mercy. Kill the bastard. See him, boys? Oh. This place looks like a smithy. What happened here? The embers are still smoldering. The fire must have occurred recently. I hope the smith is safe and sound. Maybe I can find him somewhere here. Your legs too short to get here, huh? You foolish abomination! Get out of there! I'll throw a stone at your head! What kind of all of the rocks then take care of this? I think I need to help him. Thanks be to the gods. I thought that monster would tear me to shreds. Where did you learn how to do this? A soldier does not forget how to fight. I passed by a destroyed forge along the way. Do you know what happened to the smith? Yes, unfortunately I do. My name is Firtas. It so happens that I'm his apprentice. I will tell you everything of how it happened, but I still need your help. What's the matter? I need to retrieve my master's old tools. They should be in those ruins, not far from here, but the place, it instills me with fear. By the way, 
I can see that you could use some new equipment. If you bring me these tools, I can teach you a couple tricks of the trade. What do you say? So be it. I shall look for them. You're a lifesaver. We will meet near the smithy. But first, I'll make sure there are no maggots around. See a shrine. This must be the entrance to the ruins Firtus was talking about. Thank <laughs> you. 
places like this bear witness to the bygone glory of Greece. smell of fraud. Maybe I'll find tools and the seals on the lead. They must be the key to unlocking this lock. I think I saw them somewhere around here. There are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all.
God, what kind of magic trick is this? I think I can see an entrance to the ruins inside. I'm outside. How is this possible? You cannot forge that kind of chisel and caliper in all of my cine. Many thanks. If it weren't for you, my master would have surely skinned me alive. Speaking of your master... You see, it seems he was kidnapped. A few weeks ago, some people offered him a job. I didn't like them from the very beginning. There was something sinister in their eyes. They tried to persuade him to take the job, but my master is renowned for his high principles. He refused. So last night they came here and kidnapped him, put a torch to the smithy, and I, I couldn't do anything. Do you know where they could have taken him? They mentioned a camp in the mountains beyond the bridge and the village. I wanted to go and rescue him, but I, I thought it would be better if I looked after his things. It is not safe around here. You are wise to stay here. Do not worry. I shall bring your master back. Thank you, and take care. These people are dangerous.
Somebody help! See him, boys? <laughs> <laughs> You won't, but let me leave. Ha! This'll be easier than I thought. Give me that son of a bitch. force is blocking the passage. walk through here yet. Don't kill me! <laughs> Suck your tail and run. Something's blocking the passage.
See him, boys!
Something's blocking the passage. By the order of Menelaus, the road to Mycenae is closed. Wait a minute. I recognize your armor. You're one of the Myrmidons, am I right? I always dreamed of crossing swords with one of you, and finding out whether what they say about you is true. I have no time for that, and I have no quarrel with you. I kindly ask you to let me go. Did I hear you right? You think I'm a weakling? Or maybe you're just a coward? Draw your weapon and face me! Right here and now! It seems like you leave me no choice. No warrior has managed to defeat me yet. I hope you won't disappoint me. was a worthy fight. Please forgive me for doubting your abilities. Tell me, why did you spare me? I also used to think that I was invincible. However, there was one who proved me wrong. You've got the strength of a dozen men. Do not waste it on feeding your own humans. Instead, use it to help others. I will do just that. Thank you, great warrior. I will not forget this lesson. A shrine. I don't seek trouble. I'm just cutting down this tree. Ladder is too high up. I definitely can't pass through here.
Surrender or die! I'm getting better at this. Be easier than I thought.
Some invisible force is blocking the passage. Take what you want, but let me leave. Kill the bastard. <laughs>
him, you understand? They took him away from me. Calm down and tell me what happened. A couple of days ago, soldiers came to our home. They were looking for valuables. Where the hell would I get them from when I have barely anything to eat? After they didn't find anything, they took an interest in my boy. They said he's in the prime of his life. He must join the army. I knew that if I gave him to them, I'd lose him forever. I stood up to them, but I barely made it out alive. You're acting like common bandits, not soldiers. Where will I find them? These rascals are still occupying our house. Maybe my boy is still there? I'll beat you! Tuck your tail and run! Suck your tail and run. <laughs> Thank you.
Tuck your tail and run!
Somebody! Help! Someone's looking for trouble. See a shrine. Entering a mountainous terrain. I guess I am headed in the right direction. Oh. Bodies have been looted. 
Could it be that the bandits Virtus mentioned passed through here? Give me your money, bastard! It seems that the kidnappers left behind quite the bloody trail. Shouldn't have come here. I'll do it once I get rid of the ants.
The smith must be closed. But when I finally meet him, what shall I say? Fortunately, I don't have to roll some kind of boulder up this hill. So, you're the one who's been slaughtering me men like pigs. Tell me what you want, or you'll get an arrow between your eyes. Supposedly, you and your band hold the smith prisoner here. Is that right? That's none of your business, you stray. Besides, he came here in vain. The guy busted himself out, went inside the mountain, and that's the last we saw of him. In that case, I'll go look for him. Get out of my way, and you shall leave to see another day. You've got balls, I'll give you that. But you're not getting something. There's only one of you, and a whole band of us. Besides, the armor you're wearing looks interesting. Menelaus will pay handsomely for it. And usually I don't like opportunities to pass me by. Kill him! Kill the bastard! <laughs> <laughs> See him, boys? These gates lead to the inside of the mountain. They must be opened by some kind of lever. should be open now. This must be some kind of abandoned stronghold. A very old stronghold. It's moving.
battle, these narrow passages would have been great for defense. Even no sign of a smith. Maybe he is. No. I have to keep him.
Pirtos. I completely forgot about him. Did you talk to him? I did. He wanted to find you and save you. But I took him out of it. You did well. You would have only gotten in trouble. I already got him out of some trouble. Big and thorny trouble. And damn it. He was probably wandering alone in those old ruins again and awakened some monstrosity. I told him not to do that. <laughs> I suspected that while I was away, he might get some foolish ideas, but I didn't think he was gonna try and get himself killed. But it seems like I have no other choice. It's time to go. These luminous circles are quite useful. I've been seeing them more frequently in the area. <sighs> listen. Listen, if you need my help, I need to know whether you're not just another glory and loot seeking brawler. Grease has enough of them already. How am I supposed to prove that? Hmm. In an old temple, not far from here. People have been disappearing. I don't know if they've been kidnapped by some bandits, or if there's a beast lurking in there. I want you to solve that problem. I am not your errand boy. And it isn't my duty to help you until I see that you do something for the common folk. <sighs> I'll check that place out. Stay behind, and don't let yourself get captured again. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'll make my way to this movie shortly. We will see each other there once you're done. Oh, one more thing. When you return, use the shortcut at the end of the pass. Just don't forget to throw the ladder down. The oaks who dragged me here said they use it a lot. Another venture ahead of me, and I have even more questions and fewer answers. The dead rising from their graves. Monsters I've known only from legends prowling the roads. And soldiers under a man whom I trusted want to kill me. And these damned apparitions, it felt like they were looking for me.
Give me your money, bastard! His armor must be worth a full point. Give me your money, bastard! Shrine, at last.
nice birdie. Come here, you worm. This looks like the entrance. I feel a piercing cold in this place. you agreed to take care of this matter. I'm certain you'll handle it. Each of your men is worth five of Menelaus' soldiers. Take the armor I managed to rustle up. You have to arrange weapons yourselves. Somewhere in those ruins, the bandits must have their hideout. Kill them all, with no exception. Now I'm giving you an advance. You'll get the other half when you finish the job. Maybe I should find out more about this. What are you doing here? What happened to them? I... I killed them! Get it? I killed them! <laughs> I... that voice made me do it! Keeps piercing my mind like a bloody dagger! I can't take it anymore! You're a stranger here. A stranger in the Lord's home. Your death shall please him!
the underworld. Wait. Yes. Yes. The underworld is okay. <laughs> Symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. No less. They're coming from the top and bottom. They were supposed to be common bandits and not these corpses. They won't take me alive. Gods, forgive me for what I'm about to do. Every warrior is nothing against many. Well, almost every warrior.
There are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. I just remembered that. Moments after the deadly strike reached me, I began to plunge into the abyss. I thought I was falling, but I was actually drowning. Drowning surrounded by the cavernous darkness of the water's depths. And even though my lungs were filled with water and my body was overcome by the cold, I did not die. That was quite useful. It's you. We talked at the cemetery. I didn't expect to see you here. Someone has to take care of these places. Abandoned, full of memories and pain. Times have changed and death, like life, is worth little more than a handful of ashes. You look quite pale. Are you all right? No, not entirely. Lately, I've been seeing some apparitions. They look like they don't belong in this world. Where did they come from? The apparitions you encounter on your journey are suspended between the kingdoms of the living and of the dead. They must be finding their way here in places where the line between the worlds is thinnest. Why are they haunting me? They're looking for souls who avoided judgment and returned to the world of the living. Souls? Does that mean I'm... That, that would explain why you lost your memory, and you can see things others can't. Not only do I see them, but I can feel more than before. 
The shrines you mentioned are drawing me toward them. As if I became a part of them. They connect the world of the living and the underworld. It seems that your soul got split between these two kingdoms, and that's why it is drawn to the shrines. I don't understand. If I'm dead, why would I return to the living? It seems you've been given another chance. And there is something important ahead for you to do. I have a piece of advice for you. Try to focus on your goal. That will help you in times of doubt. That's the shortcut the smith mentioned. I need to throw this ladder down. And now to the ground. A place at the intersection of both worlds. That must be one of the rifts the stranger was talking about. There's a way to seal it somehow. I need to get inside. Whoa! 
countless days, my body started to decay, and consciousness started to leave my exhausted mind. Death and life lost meaning. I might have just as well not existed at all, and maybe that would have been better for everyone.
That's how these damned apparitions emerge. Faster than I expected. Did you manage to put the temple in order? I got rid of a raid hunting that place. Now it's time for you to answer my questions. Did you see warriors wearing armor similar to mine anywhere? I was their commander. Really? You lost your own unit. <laughs> I admit you're a good leader. I woke up with a gap in my memory. Ten years after the war broke out. I don't know what I'm doing here, where my men are, and why some fucking voice ordered me to find you. You must think I'm mad, and I don't blame you. I myself no longer believe my own thoughts. Yeah, truth be told, I heard more convincing stories at roadside inns. But I believe you. <sighs> after the war ended, people said that Menelaus was supposed to take leadership of the Myrmidons. I would talk to him if I were you. Where would I find him? Ah, not so fast. As far as I know, he closed his residence shut. Not even a mouse can sneak in. Besides, there are still people around here who need help. And only one of us is a warrior. What am I supposed to do now? Ah, Lysander, a hunter who brings me hides regularly, is late with his delivery. I hope he's not in some kind of trouble. I'll check on him. And meanwhile, I can cut a way for you to get into Menelaus' residence.
Thank you for bringing back my master safe and sound. Not for one second did I doubt you could do it. By the way, he was asking about you. I think you should talk to him. Another favor. I'm not his errand boy. On the other hand, what choice do I have? Since Menelaus took over leadership of the Vengeance, he must know where they are and why. Thomas for his henchmen. Please, the souls. I need 
to destroy dispersed objects. That's everything this... What's his name? Lysander had on it. Just some useless junk. Wave the blade in front of him, and he'll squeal where he keeps something more valuable. Or, at least show us where he hid his daughter. Hey, someone has sneaked in here. You blind? Look at his armor. It's one of those... What are they called? Myrmidons. Myrmidons. That's what I said. The both of us can cut him up no problem. Maybe the soldiers will even give us a prize. You're right. Let's get him. <laughs> See you, right? to pay tribute to me? The Lord of the Roads? Why are you gaping as if you were tongue-tied? Want to end up like this hunter? I don't see no Lord here. 
closed. Just a coward, mugging defenseless foe. Release this man. You scum! I'll order my people to tie you up to a tree and skin you alive. You mean those thugs guarding the camp entry? I already took care of them. You did what? Do you know how difficult it is to find a qualified thug nowadays? I see two ways forward. Release Lysander and I'll forget I ever met you. Or you'll join your comrades. The choice is yours. Ever since Menelaus closed Mycenae off on the order of that crowned fool, poverty has been rampant everywhere. Everyone is doing what they can to survive. That doesn't give you the right to prey on others. Release that poor man while I still have some patience left. You can't tell me what to do, you mutt! will be safer without you. You're safe now. The smith sent me. My daughter. She ran away from the bandits. Please, you have to help her. Calm down and tell me exactly what happened. Like every year before the festival, I went hunting for game in honor of our goddess. Cloyote insisted on joining me. We went into the woods and the bandits assaulted us. I shouted for her to run and then I lost sight of her. These words are full of vicious beasts. Please, oh noble warrior, find her. I'll give you everything I own. Stay here. I'll bring your daughter back. Not far from here, I saw signs of a wolf feeding. That's where we separated. Perhaps that's where you should begin your search. These traces of blood are barely visible. Maybe my seeing gifts will help me see more. of a tunic. I think I'm on the right track. Oh, my God. 
the trucks lead to the other side of the pass. I have to think of a way to get there. Money, bastard. Coyote? Hold on. I'll get you out of there. No. Don't come closer. She... she's still here. Lurking in the dark. A shield in the woods brought you to this world. And I'll take you out of it. Oh. Come here. Closer. Never have to bury their child, Malaka. It's been a while since I've seen a shrine.
This should make things easier. See a shrine.
another croc. I need to seal it. Where's my daughter? Where's Cryote? She's dead. Dead? Uh, I don't believe you. I reached the lair of a she-wolf. I killed the beast, but Cryote's wounds were too severe. There was nothing more I could do. Tell me. Did she suffer? She passed away peacefully. She said that it wasn't your fault. And that she loved you. You took her away, goddess of the hunt. The most precious thing in my life. Why did you take her and not me? I don't know what it's like to lose a daughter, but... I once lost my entire unit. Those were the best men a commander could wish for. The only thing keeping me alive is the goal. A new goal. I turned grief into strength that leads me. Tell me, what kind of a girl could the father of a deceased daughter fight? Something terribly wrong is happening in this realm. Help people. Lend them your abilities and your grief. It will lighten with time. Take these hides. Sell them. Use them. Do whatever you want with them. I don't want to look at them.
these are the heights from Lysander. <laughs> Good job. They're fresh and ready for trimming. Uh, why do you seem so down? During the hunt, Lysander and Cleote were ambushed by bandits. I managed to save him, but his daughter is dead. Fell victim to the wolves. I had a feeling I could save her. Lysander knew the risks of taking a child hunting, but he still made that decision. If that little birdie was hunted down by the pack, her chances were really slim. You did well. You did what you could, lad. You have to understand that you won't be able to save everyone. Especially when people don't exercise due caution. Speaking of caution, Firtos was muttering about some troubles. <laughs> he's a pick of a lad. I should have left him in that damn army if he's so eager to get into trouble. Help him. And meanwhile, I'll tan these hides and start preparing a... Well, you'll see for yourself. I heard that you got yourself into some trouble again. The Master sent me to search for a very durable raw material. I asked around and a certain former friend told me I can find it in the ruins near Mycenae. No sooner had I gone inside than a scorpion jumped on me. A huge, ugly one. I barely made it out alive. Do you always have to wander around ruins and wake huge scorpions up? <sighs> Where will I find it? In a rocky canyon near the fishing spot. Surely you'll find it. When you take care of him, bring me a few pieces of its armor. They may come in handy for Master's new project. Take what you want, but let me leave.
something intangible here. Something's here. If only I could take a closer look. Someone is in trouble.
This monstrosity must have hidden deep down. Grieved at heart. Glad to have escaped death. Though we have lost our dear comrades, I wonder what we get from that. <laughs> The bastard! Oh. <laughs> the scorpion is no more. Thanks. You've saved my life for the second time already. If that monstrosity wandered off here, I don't even want to think about what it would do to me. I see you managed to get armor pieces from that monster. Take them to my master. He'll know what to do with them. You'll find him in our new workshop, not far from here. I almost forgot. Take these few trinkets as a token of my gratitude. I'm sure they will be of more use to you than me.
Something's here. If only I could take a closer look. I see you've made yourself quite comfortable here. <sighs> that old hellhole was no longer good for anything. These are scorpion armor pieces, and not just any. They'll be useful for the plan I concocted. Plainly speaking, you'll go to Menelaus' residence in disguise. <laughs> disguise? Perhaps I shall dress up as a horse as well. <sighs> That's not such a stupid plan. But I have a better one. Menelaus is looking for a new henchman for his crew. But he won't admit to anyone. Especially not someone flaunting Myrmidon armor. I'll make you armor that will evoke awe and respect among his soldier boys. I'm certain you will get inside easily with it. It will take me a moment, but I promise you that the result will be worthwhile. Well, come on. Try it on. Tough as Cyclops skin. Huh. Fits me perfectly. Why did you choose a scorpion for the symbol? That was Furtus' idea. I think he just wanted to return the favor. Besides, he couldn't have chosen anything better. You're just as stubborn as those beasts. You can bite fiercely, and you never give up. Thank you. That is truly a unique gift. I must now head forth. When you stand before Menelaus, remember that he's no more than the raging dog on Agamemnon's leash. It was the king's decisions that drowned Greece in blood. I will make Menelaus sing, and his brother will suffer the same fate. Good luck, boy. I hope you know what you're getting yourself into.
blacksmithing as an art that has awned over years. And I had plenty of time to master all its secrets. Trust me. I think I can see a shrine. Kill the bastard! Kill the bastard!
I can see a shrine. Here! Please, I need your help! A girl? I should check what this- Who are you? Are you lost? My name's Ianthi. I'm waiting for my brothers. They went into that cave across, but they're still not coming back. What were they looking for in there? They said that they found something extraordinary in there, and that surely I wouldn't believe it when I saw it. They insisted I go with them. Everything happened so fast. I remember them suddenly screaming, and I ran away. I rushed out of the cave, but I couldn't find them anywhere. I don't know for how long I've been waiting for them. Please, find my brothers. I'm afraid something has happened to them. I will go look for them. Meanwhile, you stay on those rocks. You'll be safe there. His armor must be worth a fortune. A passage. Interesting. Come any closer. Haven't you heard the passage is closed? By the way, how did you get past that warrior on the bridge? I saw him chopping off a cyclops's head with just one cut. He fought bravely and wore impressive armor. But still, he couldn't defeat me. I heard that Manelaus is looking for a new man for his army. I wanted to volunteer, 
The commander did open up admissions to his army again. You can pass, but be quick about it before those living dead return. And remember, when you stand before Menelaus, show him due respect. I can see a shrine. to opening that chest. There are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all.
What do you mean you don't know where he is? I searched the entire village, but there was no sign of him, my lord. Am I to understand that a fucking ghost is slaughtering my people? Go on with your search. I want him dead or alive. And one more thing. When you report to the king, remember about the passage papers with my seal. No one can get into my CD without them. Yes, my lord. Your armor is impressive. But where do you come, warrior? I was fighting in Troy. I appreciate soldiers with war experience. Maybe I can find a spot for you among my ranks. What brings you here? I'm looking for Myrmidons. So are we. I heard that one of those cuts is still breathing and murdering my people with impunity. If you get that dog, I'll reward you, handsome. What happened to the rest of them? They met the fate of traitors and were replaced by men loyal and devoted to the king. Since you served in Troy, you should have known that. Who are you, anyway? I used to be the commander of a unit. I led the greatest warriors that Greece has ever seen. I remember the day I led them to Troy's walls, defeated Hector, and I was supposed to rescue your wife. But none of that matters now. Achilles? That's impossible! You were dead! Dead! You're the one murdering my men, now that I know what you did. It's time for you to pay for your crimes! Guards! Guards! Stop him! Kill him! You heard the commander's orders. Take him! I should have expected this. Kill the bastard! <laughs> Don't understand. That vicious band of yours stood in the way of peace. They didn't listen to anyone but you. Look around, you fool. Wherever I look, all I see is murder and looting. Is that what you call peace? These are necessary sacrifices. And when all enemies are dead, a new order will finally reign in Greece. I used to know Menelaus who was no stranger to honor. Since Agamemnon has been pouring poison into your ears, you've become a blind servant of his will. A power-hungry monster. Maybe even Helen was nothing more than an excuse to start this hopeless war. Helen? So that's why you are here. She's mine. She will be mine forever. And you'll die like that Trojan mongrel for whom she wanted to betray me! 
I will gut you and throw you to the crows to feast on. Your commander, may your souls rest in peace. One of the soldiers mentioned something about passage papers and a seal. I need to get them if I want to see Agamemnon. This looks like... Is this... possible? Helen, you were the first victim of that sick bastard who was trying to save you from Paris, instead of protecting you from your own husband. And even after your death, that brute didn't let you go. Those must be the papers Malayas mentioned. I won't fight Helen. You were the first victim of that sick monster. This leader has opened something.
hope that gave me strength to search for them. But in the end, it proved in vain. Seal. I have everything I need to get to my city. Time to see the one proclaiming himself the King of Greece. Surrender or die!
Looking for trouble?
I can see a shrine.
Don't even think that I'm gonna let you in. Shove off before I lose my patience. I have a message from Menelaus. The papers and the seal look genuine. You have quite decent armor. Are they giving out clowns like that now? You can enter. My head. Again, this weird... memory. I remember that I felt someone's presence in the abyss. These beings were circling me with curiosity, observing me, but not attacking. What did they want from me? They were dancing around me, whispering their songs, as if I were one of them. A drunk or a maniac? What? What did you say? You heard me. As soon as you walked in, you fell and lay on the ground for quite a while. I think you're up to something. Guards! And it was such a smooth sailing. An intruder! Stop him! My Zini. Since my last visit, it's gotten worse here. Take him! The bastard! Want, but let me live. Get him. Cares for Greece as much as for oh, the city. Ah, this will be easier and than I thought. Turned it into ruins. Surrender or die. It 
It's been a while since I've seen a shrine. Kill the bastard! <laughs>
Knowing that old clown is Get perfectly horse, got son. why controlling the authorities is in the palace. I've welcomed the rulers of the world within these walls. I didn't think I would live to see the day when the ghosts of the past would start haunting me. You won't escape the past, no matter how much you wish to. So, the Oracle was right. She said you'd come back, that you come to take the crown from me. To have your name written in gold on the pages of history books. I came to stop the suffering you brought on Greece. Suffering. <laughs> I ended the war, raised Troy to the ground, and Greece became the largest power in history. Greece is drowning in blood! But how would you know? You sealed off the city, only not to see the truth. The truth that you failed as a king and defender of these lands. But even the high walls you built to separate yourself from the world couldn't stop the consequences of your own undoing. And they've come to demand their prize. Soldiers! Surround him! Kill him! Ah, he flees as cowardly as his brother. <laughs> He probably hid in the palace. I need to get there. I think I can see a shrine. Help! See him, boys! your tail and run.
Come on, no. man. Kills a Looking for trouble? Oh. to opening that chest.
See him, boys! <laughs>
Those soldiers don't fight for him out of loyalty, but out of fear of his wrath. Get the horse, <laughs> Lavishly, while his people are dying. Soon he shall pay for everything. Your reign is coming to an end. Right here. Right now. You think killing me is going to change anything? I won't bring back the lives lost to a tyranny. But I can ensure that no one else dies on your orders. <laughs> Thanks to the decisions and sacrifices I made, Greece expanded its borders like never before. And I'm at its forefront, faced with the same choices I would have made them without any hesitation. You really don't feel any remorse for what you did. You're a mad monster wearing a crown. You're a naive child. Haven't you learned that the world is ruled by power and fear? Power and fear. They're eternal, like a name engraved on a rock. They made me the most powerful man in Greece. And you, you're just a tale from the past, barely remembered by anyone. Come on, you dog. Challenge the king of kings himself. Reach for the eternal glory or perish forgotten! You fuck. I forgot how to fight? Maybe you do remember. <laughs> Pray that you can keep up with me. I had ten years to prepare for this encounter. You'll see. Humanity has already been dead for years. By killing you, I would just be doing a favor to this tormented land. Alaka, what the hell is this? The one who sowed fear throughout Greece now dies in terror. He's still hesitating. So weak. I will help him. The one who sowed fear throughout Greece has died in terror. Impressive how much fear you yourself can instill. Even though your time in this world should have long ended. Soon we shall meet again, Achilles. <laughs> Sons 
So indeed, he's here. You again? Are you following me? How did you get here? That's not relevant right now. Have you also seen that symbol? Yes, I have. I also heard someone's voice. What the hell was that? And why did it appear over his body? That's a mark of fear. And oppression. Something, or rather, someone, has just manifested their presence in this world. But his servants have been working for a long time. In the old ruins, beyond the pass, kidnappers imprisoned a group of priests. Among them is someone who could prove to be a valuable ally in the fight against the new threat. If you don't manage to free them, the consequences could be irreversible. Getting there will take me... Who are you? I'll tell you everything in due time, but we don't have much of it now. Go through the portal and free the priests. Every minute counts. Those men in black robes, they kidnapped me and my companions. They're still holding them captive there. You've got to help them. I'll go look for them, and you should find a safe shelter. Watch your step. That monster, it's still there. Monster? It was slithering through these corridors like a snake. By all that is holy, beware, a oh warrior, beware! It's been a while since I've seen a shrine.
An infidel! Kill him! symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. Please, find the other priests. They're in grave danger. symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. Be open now.
blood. The fear will consume you! No, please, don't drag me to it. I'm not one of the kidnappers. I came here to free you. Run away as fast as you can. Oh, thank the gods. The rest of my companions are still somewhere here. Please, find them. Kill him!
growing. The gods themselves must have sent you here. I don't know how to thank you. The best show of gratitude would be if you run from here and survive. Is there anyone else here? I saw a few of my companions and the oracle being led toward that precipice over there. Please, free them if you can. The fear will consume you!
Shrine. At last. Madness! Her voice. 
Show yourself. Your heart. Heating. But dead. Your name instilled fear in the toughest of warriors. Your mere presence on the battlefield undermines the morale of whole armies. Who are you? And what do you want? Who am I? I'm your admirer, Achilles. I've been closely watching you for a long time, marveling at your deeds. You intrigue me. Fate has given me a chance, and I decided to take it, just like you. You have to go right behind me. How good it is to breathe fresh air again. Thank you, Achilles. I owe you my life and the lives of others. How do you know my name? I know more about you than you think. My name is Pythia. I served people as an oracle for years. These hooded people. They were the ones who kidnapped us and brought us to these cursed ruins. A long time ago, I saw that being in my vision. How it grows and emerges from an evil warped heart. Do these visions always have to be so mysterious? What else did you see? Alas, that's everything I remember. The vision was brief and vague. To better understand the nature of that being, I'll have to retrieve knowledge from my old temple. If you want to help me with that, let's meet up by the old gate near Mycenae. It leads to the other side of the mountains. And if you know anyone from around here, you should warn them. Dark times are coming. I will do just that. I'll join you soon. Take care.
another crow. Let's see. Just you. I'm, I'm 
not in the right headspace for a chat. I can see that something's bothering you. Where's Firtos? Firtos left. Besides, it's none of your business. Tell me what you want. I wanted to warn you. After Agamemnon's death, a certain being appeared. It's not from this world. It kidnaps priests, and some followers serve it. Malaka! I could feel it in my bones that your visit to Mycenae could bring trouble. I'm starting to regret helping you. If it's as bad as you say, I'll have to warn the people around. What are you planning to do now? I need to help the Oracle. We're trying to find out more about this being. What it is, or who, and its plans. Seems that one problem caused another. Shit. What did you get yourself into this time? That hooded man knew a suspicious amount about the priests and that being. I hope I will encounter him again.
I managed to defeat them. Time to go. Need to seal it. The place of the dead is underground. And let it remain so. Shut. I want to open the gate from this side. Maybe I can find some other passage.
Good to see you, Achilles. It seems that the old gate is closed, but I managed to find this cave. The entrance to it is blocked by this symbol. I've seen it before. It's some kind of seal. It beams with a powerful, unknown force. I will try to destroy it. Wait, this problem can't be solved with muscles. Maybe I'll try taking care of it. One more time. Focus. This seal can't be broken by a mere mortal. Please allow me to help you. When you're ready, go into the cave. An honest discussion awaits us. Huh. I didn't fully believe it would work. Well, it seems that the passage is open. Let's go inside. Wait. It's too risky for you to go with me. If for some reason that creature wanted to hunt you down, it's best not to make it easy for it. Its minions might have intentionally blocked the main gate and set a trap for us in this cave. In that case, you go first and look for a way to open the gate. If I remember correctly, there were some levers on the other side. Oh, my 
I thought gods didn't exist. I must A danger has come that threatens both the world of the living and the dead. The consequences of the Why did you hide your true nature from me? Many signs suggest that fear plays a crucial role in current events. That's why you saw me in inhuman form. The process that has started can still be stopped. But to accomplish this, we'll have to trust each other, Achilles. I now have to leave to try and delay the decaying of my kingdom. I don't understand any of this. Now I 
I remember everything. Just when I thought I would spend eternity in the realm of the dead, he appeared. I took his hand, and he pulled me from the deepest depths. Out of all people, he chose me, a mere mortal. I was supposed to set out for a new war, the most important war of my life. My courage combined with the power of sticks was supposed to be the weapon that would give us a chance of winning, and that would save both worlds from the impending doom. It's been a while since I've seen you. It must be worth a fortune. Give me your money, bastard! See a shrine. They can leave you alone with all this mess. From what the Oracle managed to tell me, the situation looks serious. I can already sense a foreign aura that is weakening me here. I'm afraid the minions of that being have reached these parts. They may have taken over my temple. Make sure it's safe there, Achilles. You will find it near the mountain range. If that being's force corrupted my temple, you'll have to find a way to clear it of its influence. Before you go, I also would like to ask you for a favor. I need to retrieve a certain... old hammer infused with great power. Uh, to take on something outside the world of the living. You'll need much better equipment. I can't make any with the crap I have on hand. The hammer is somewhere in the labyrinth, erected on a certain island. Sounds like a fairy tale. But I've trusted you so far, and I'll trust you now, too. How do I get there? Reach the harbor and embark on a ship, and sail straight ahead east. Surely you'll find it. I'll look around for that hammer and check the temple. You, too, should stay behind. Good luck, Achilles. Hopefully, our joint effort can save Greece.
suck you, Sanyo. Something's here. If only I could take a closer look. Get me that son of a bitch. See him, boys! Surrender or die! Surrender or die! There are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. Be open now.
see a shrine. Malaka, the Spectres again. I've defeated the likes of you before, so I can defeat you too.
Time to take care of the rest. The temple seems safe. Thank you, Achilles. You've freed the place I've been bound to for years, even though a lot has changed here. The temple was haunted by two specters, but I expelled them. I also found some mosques with frightening countenances. The temple was erected in a place where the line between the worlds is very thin. They may have accumulated the energy of these specters, corrupting the place. I don't care about the masks. The most important thing is that you got rid of those ghosts. And I have a place where I can make your equipment. Of course. Once you bring me that hammer I told you about. Help the blacksmith, Achilles. Meanwhile, I'll recite my prayers to unite with the power of this place. I know you've done plenty already, but we will both benefit from the hammer. If you need any supplies for the way, go ahead and tell me.
since I've seen a shrine. That's how these damned apparitions emerge. Get me that son of a bitch! <laughs> Thank you, good sir. See a shrine. You look like a great warrior, stranger. I can see it in your eyes, the scars adorning your body. You were in the army, 
were you not? Many years ago, during the Trojan War. But that's an old tale. So, you were in luck, having experienced the soldier's life. The life of honor. I've lost mine forever. Tell me your story. First, I disappointed my brother. Then, my commander. I couldn't save them from the downfall, even though I had the chance. If I hadn't joined Titus' band, everything could have turned out differently. The ideas? The son of a bitch who took care of this part of Greece. But in reality, he's nothing more than a murderer. He deserves to die in agony for the crimes he committed. I know that my remorseful words aren't enough. So I'd like to die by the hand of someone like you. It's the only way for me to cleanse the stain on my name. Will you give me a death worthy of a warrior? If that is your wish, get ready to fight. I don't wish for anything else. You promised! I've done many mistakes myself, but wishing for one's death is plain cowardice, not a solution. Greece is bleeding, and it needs heroes like never before. Leave and fight its enemies to restore your honor, warrior.
are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. This ship will do. I can get to the art. All right. I think I'm here. If I hadn't sailed on similar ships in the past, I'm sure I would have crashed into this dumb box. soul inside. in the name of the God. Someone tried to hide behind these doors.
while since I've seen a shrine. Get the whole shot! But I need to find a way to open it. Hammer could be anywhere, literally. The place looks ancient. I wonder how this myth found out about it. It's not the way. Thank <laughs> you. 
on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all.
everything here opened by those dumb levers? Another living statue, made entirely out of metal.
closed shut. I need to open it somehow. The passage should be open now. in the right direction.
Maybe I can open it if I find it. I wonder what else the smith failed to mention about this place. I have a bad feeling about this. I better prepare.
that was supposed to be just an easy favor for the smith. That hammer has to be somewhere in here. There are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. with living fire. How did this smith find out? The ship is right where I left it. Excellent. Time to get back to... Help the smith, and I'll draw on the power that lies within the temple. I managed to retrieve the hammer you told me about. <laughs> well done. I was beginning to doubt whether I hadn't sent you perhaps in vain. Did everything go smoothly? Besides sharp as knife rocks, the undead, metal statues, and a half-man, half-bull, it was a piece of cake. I didn't want to torment you with unnecessary details. Anyway, you did a hell of a good job. Harnessing its power is gonna take me some time. Oh, by the way, the Oracle wanted to speak with you.
Thank you, Achilles. You've freed the place I've been bound to for years, even though a lot has changed here. The temple was haunted by two specters, but I expelled them. I also found some mosques with frightening countenances. The temple was erected in a place where the line between the worlds is very thin. They may have accumulated the energy of these specters, corrupting the place. I don't care about the masks. The most important thing is that you got rid of those ghosts. And I have a place where I can make your equipment. Achilles, I'm going to need another thing from you. I need an item infused with that being's power to maintain the integrity of my vision. I remember that one of the kidnappers was wearing a ring with that cursed symbol. I believe it will help us better understand what we're fighting against. Can you tell me more about the kidnapper? It was a bold man with a scar and black paint on his face. He frightened those hooded fanatics, so I assume he was their leader. Go look for him in the harbor. There is no shortage of bandits and troublemakers there. Maybe you'll come across his trail. I will return once I find out something about him.
the symbols must be the key to opening that chest. Get the horse up! Tuck your tail and run! Now I can open the chest. Thank you, good sir. Take him! Shrine. I can rest by. The bastard! He's a son of a bitch! Uh. Uh. 
What do we have here? Another lost lamb? I'll find a place for you too. Release these people, and I'll let you go and think about your life. <laughs> their, their time hasn't come. <laughs> he who is marked is waiting for the Lord's orders. When he receives them, they will play their part. And then everything will begin. That's enough of this nonsense. See him, boys! <laughs> <laughs> Grace of the gods be upon you, warrior. Thank you a hundredfold for the rescue. trying to do with you. They thought we were priests. They said that they would tie us up to logs and offer us to their lord, and that our souls will serve him for eternity. When they were interrogating me in their hideout, the bold madman with painted face kept talking about him. Do you remember where exactly that hideout is? Go along the shore toward that large square, the former site of city gatherings. Near it, there is an entrance to the underground. Hide with the rest. I'll take care of him.
I don't know how to thank you, stranger. Sink him, boys! <laughs> Kill the battle. I saw how that madman tried to... Just the thought of it makes me sick. A passage to the underground near the square. I need to get there. Kill the bastard! <laughs> This must be the place that woman mentioned. Well, well, well. A hero that returned. I've heard of you, Achilles. My lord has foreseen that you'd soon pay me a visit. Know that he will surely appreciate your voluntary sacrifice. Why are you kidnapping people? <laughs> I'd most gladly throw them to the lions, but... My lord has recognized a potential in them, and in his generosity, let them serve him. Even after death. They will join his ranks that are awaiting his sign. And then I... His most loyal servant shall lead them to war that will drown Greece in blood and fear! Why are you so certain that it's you who's going to lead them? It just so happens. I also spoke with your lord. He said that he sees similarity between us and that he admires me. 
admires you? You're lying. Lying like a dog. You want to deprive me of my honor? Only I am worthy enough to sit beside him. And as a token of that, I shall give him your head. I didn't offer him hundreds of lives on the altar of war for some loafer to take away my glory. My glory! I didn't come here for glory. I came here to punish you for your crimes. <laughs> You bold fool! You'll be begging for mercy! True strength is forged in the heat of battle and on the anvil of fear! Take me now! You are too dangerous to let leave. The Greek citizens will be relieved when they learn of your death. See him, boy! Ah! 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 
This is the ring. Its owner was the right-hand man of the being we're looking for. It beams with a powerful force. The same one I felt at the sealed doors. I hope it can help direct my vision. The line between the world of the living and the dead is very thin here. I don't know how powerful my vision will be, or what consequences it will bring. Remember everything you're about to hear, and don't get scared. Voy triste mas, ski es donne kron. Voy triste mas, ski es donne kron. My kingdom is crumbling again. With each moment I stand outside the underworld. I involuntarily cause its collapse. So listen to me carefully. The being we're looking for is named Phobos. He considers himself a god, even though he's a far cry from one. Until recently, he did not have a physical form. He was born in Norwood as a consequence of the fear that was instilled in people's hearts after the Trojan War. He feeds on it. It gives him strength. I was hoping that your courage would cause it to focus on you, giving us more time to end the crisis. He must have his lair somewhere on the line between the worlds. He's ordering his servants from there. They're coming toward us. You must stop them. Time to explain. Take care of them. I'll protect the Oracle. Go face the enemy, Achilles. I'll protect the Oracle. of our Lord. You gave them hell, Achilles, as always. Well done, 
You better explain what I just saw. Well, I wanted to get away from my past, but things turned out differently. You've already met my uncle, Hades. Long ago, I was the patron and god of fire, smiths, and craftspeople. They called me Hephaestus. And you're only telling me this now? I just... Uh, I just didn't want to be a god anymore. I abused this hammer with my power and hid it far away from everyone. If I had to choose between one evil and another, I'd rather not to choose at all. But since the fate of Greece is at stake, I couldn't remain passive. Help, especially divine help, is now immensely needed. Dispense with the courtesies. After all, we've known each other for some time now. You better tack on the Oracle. I think she's regaining consciousness. Blacksmithing is an art that is odd over years. And I had plenty of time to master all its secrets. Trust me. Still feeling dizzy. What happened? Hades spoke through you. He warned me about the enemies that attacked the temple. Have... I mean, the smith will explain everything in due time. Now you must rest. Before the darkness overcame me, I saw something else. I saw them. They were like giant shadows stretching over the horizon. I saw the arrival of the three heralds of terror. The first one came from the plains, the second from the sea, the third from the mountains. Flames, plague, and madness trailed behind them. Stop them, Achilles, and bring me something that belongs to them. I believe the power enchanted in such objects will allow me to see where Phobos is hiding. Time to find those heralds and stop them, whoever they are. You butchered my flock, mortals, a weak. However, your poor victory doesn't mean much. Neither the tricks no. of that witch nor your <laughs> weapons him, boys? can stop those who've come.
must be worth a fortune. to opening that chest. It's been a 
while since I've seen a shrine.
Finally, someone who can help me has come. What happened? Weeds. These damned weeds everywhere. They mushroomed over my field, spitting poison left and right. I'm sure it's Pavlos' fault. He's my neighbor. He always envied my crops. And if that wasn't enough, he miraculously made these weeds grow, spit poison, and take my whole field. You could use a lesson in good manners. But all right, I'll take care of it. These plants sound dangerous. Get me out of a bitch! Thank you, good sir.
got rid of those damned weeds? No? What are you waiting for? For them to reproduce? defeated the heralds of terror you saw. I heard Phobos' voice near them. He sounded much stronger than before. By defeating his chosen ones, you have dealt him a blow. He is weakened, but doesn't let it show. You think? I have a feeling that whatever I touch, I only make it worse. Many years ago, I tried to end the war. I failed, and if that's not enough, I couldn't save my own soldiers from death. Later, I challenged the one who unleashed that war, when suddenly by a weird twist of fate, Phobos appeared and drowned Greece in chaos before my very eyes. Greece has been drowning in chaos for many years, Achilles. The appearance of someone like Phobos was only a matter of time, and not your fault. It's normal to feel doubt, but remember this. If it weren't for you, I would have died along with all the other priests. Your courage caused things to turn out differently. I know one thing for sure. As long as Phobos is alive, peace won't return to Greece. In that case, we have to do everything we can to expel him from this world, once and for all. I'll examine the things you've brought me, and you should talk to Hephaestus. As far as I know, he has an important task for you. I heard you have an important task for me. The enemy you're going to face doesn't come from this world. It has a power mightier at its disposal than all the enemies you've fought so far. For you to have a fighting chance, I need to forge you armor worthy of the gods themselves. However, such work requires extremely rare, raw materials. Supposedly a beast with claws harder than the hardest iron alloy once prowled the area. Material of this grade will be invaluable for my new work. Where should I look for this beast? The thing is, I have no idea. You won't do without an expert hunter's help. A large group of refugees from my senior arrived recently at the harbor. Possibly you'll find a hunter among them. In that case, I'm off to find one. The woman I rescued from the hands of Tydeus' man seemed well informed. 
Maybe she could point me to a hunter. I need to find her.
These cursed souls won't be coming out of here. You need to help them! They're gonna kill every last one of them! Do you understand? Calm down. Who's killing whom? These sons of bitches kidnapped the villagers. They want to murder them! When there was a change of guard, I managed to escape. But the rest weren't so lucky. These madmen are holding them behind the shipyard. I'll take a look around, and you find some shelter. I'll beat you bloody! See him, boys! <laughs>
kill the battle. <laughs> The gods, I thought this was the end. Looking for an expert hunter. Do you know someone like that here? If he was in the last group of refugees, he should be in the village near the swamps. But I'm afraid you're too late. How come? People say that a great beast attacked the village. A few defenders faced it, but didn't stand the slightest chance against it. If he managed to survive, it must have been some miracle. I need to try and find him. Thanks for the information. Take care. If you believe the rumors, that beast is a true monstrosity. I need to get to the village. Traces suggest something huge run through here. I need to assess the situation and find the hunter. Lysander? What are you doing here? After Cleotes' death, I wanted to take my own life. But I met this family. They wouldn't be able to survive in the wilderness on their own for long, so I helped them. When we saw that the old gate near Mycenae was open, we went to the harbor and then to this village. However, the war has reached us here too. By the way, what are you doing here? 
I need to hunt down a beast whose claws are tougher than iron. Supposedly, it's prowling the area. I saw it running through the locals and charging through the village. These madmen in black robes must have startled it. Until now, I thought these creatures existed only in fairy tales. But my eyes did not lie. It was a chimera. Check if anyone in the village managed to survive and bring these people to me. Meanwhile, I'll prepare something that will help you hunt this monster down. I think I can see a shrine. Exactly that. An infidel! Kill him!
promise anything. I'm not one of them. I came to save you. Save us? God. And I thought you were one of those lunatics. Run toward the Harbor Strait. My friend will take care of you there. Gods themselves must have sent you here. I won't ever forget that. I won't find any more survivors. Time to return to Lysander. By the gods, I thought this was the end.
that's how these damned apparitions emerge. That's everyone I managed to find. I'm afraid the rest are dead. You did what you could. These people and I, we won't forget your sacrifice. People said that the Chimera tried to hide in the cave in, not far from here. You will need bait to lure it out. Take this bundle. It's fresh lamb coated in pork fat. An aroma like that will surely lure that beast out of the deepest of depths. Thanks for the help. Try to get to the harbor and flee on the ship going as far away from here as possible. It should be a bit safer there. All right, we'll do that. Thank you for everything, Achilles. Once again, thank you for everything you did, Achilles. May luck never leave your sight.
creature you've slain was one of the last of its kind. Astonishing, Achilles. I was hoping you'd have more respect for this. Rest. Talk to Hephaestus. I think he has something for you. I've got the claws of the beast you asked for. They belong to a chimera that terrorized the area. Lysander helped me track it. He made peace with his daughter's dad and is now helping the refugees. Deep inside, I believed he would cope with this loss. While you were out, I introduced Pitya to a small project I had on my mind. Give me these claws and wait a minute. That minute lasted longer than I expected. But admittedly, I got a bit rusty. To have a fighting chance against Phobos, you need armor worthy of the gods. Looks impressive. I sense a weird aura coming from it. What did you use to make it? I added the rings of Phobos, Heralds of Terror. Pythia didn't need them anymore, and I had to infuse the armor with divine power. Without that small detail, you wouldn't be able to even approach Phobos. <sighs> it's a shame that Furtis isn't here to see this armor. On the other hand, if Hades hadn't taken him to his kingdom, Perhaps I wouldn't have helped you at all. Hades imprisoned Firtos? Why didn't you tell me about this sooner? And what was I supposed to tell you? That the Lord of the World of the Dead has taken my apprentice? Hades cares about his own kingdom, and he'll do anything to save it. Most of the gods are like that. He looks out for his own interests. But let's focus on our task. This armor will allow you to face Phobos. Pythia will explain the rest. Once again, thank you, my friend. You speak as if you already had one foot in the grave. Go to Pythia and stop wallowing. You have a battle to win. Looking for a sturdy shield? Or maybe you prefer a more direct approach? What do you need?
Good to see you, Achilles. While you were gone, I had another vision. I saw a great battlefield. I saw suffering that overflowed into the underworld and sowed seeds of fear in the living and the dead. Beyond the swamps, on the line between both worlds, I saw it. Phobos Lair. Then I know where to go now. Remember, you have to be careful. I'm certain that Phobos has prepared for your arrival. Thank you, Pythia. For everything. Take care. May the light never leave your heart, Achilles. Even in this darkest of hours. I need to find the path to the battlefield, Pythia Soul. That's how I'll get to Phobos. That plane is somewhere beyond the village. I need to get there. it again. It's pressing into my head like a spear's blade. It's hissing into my ears when I close my eyes and when I open them. Today it was a lot stronger than usual. I feel I'm not going to be able to resist it. Brother and sister, forgive me. I need to take a look around. Maybe my vision gift will help me. Some way to bring you back to life. If I did so, you can return too. Return? The Trojan War has just begun, Commander, and you want to return? There are many victories ahead of us! Oh! 
waited for so long to finally find you. Dead. Dead. I haven't felt more alive. Lead us, Commander. Later today, we'll be feasting in the gardens of Troy. Gardens? You don't understand? You're dead. Dead! time ago and he was laughing while you were dying in agony your heart will die in agony if we remain on this beach a minute longer our hearts yearn for battle clogger send us to the walls Soldier, is that really you? Commander, it's good that I found you. As per your orders, we're going to approach the walls. 
When we enter the city, the Trojans will get what's coming to them. The Trojans? No. You're dead. You've been dead for a long time. Now I can open the chest. Me, soldier, it's really me. You're just a liar, or an enemy in disguise. Get the hell out of here. Soldier, you can stand at ease. What the...? I thought we were similar, and I was wrong all along. 
Even beneath these pieces of metal pulled together, your weaknesses can be seen at a glance. Your weak Achilles. And someone like you dares to challenge me? Pathetic. Mammy! My brother! I don't want to fight! I'm wrong! You're just an illusion! You're not here! Understand the nature of humans at all. You've greeted countless souls in your kingdom. No wonder you don't feel attached to any of them. I knew each of my men. I fought and bled by their side. Did you say the same thing to Hephaestus when you threw Virtus into your kingdom? My nephew has always been stubborn. He wouldn't forge the armor you're wearing on his own. I had to properly motivate him. Spare me the explanations. Why won't you just challenge Phobos to a duel yourself? Phobos would have never faced me, but you attracted his attention by killing his minions and escaping his traps time and time again. You ridiculed his divinity. Don't let the sacrifice of your men be in vain. Finish what you started, Achilles, and your world as well as mine will be saved. That's 
what you're afraid of the most is a dead disappointment. <gasps> Yeah. <laughs> 
see him, boys? Gods, I thought this was the end. This time, he'll have the courage to face me. Don't let your stubbornness blind your sound mind. Armor your will and can resist the corrupting power of Phobos. But you yourself have to be extremely careful of doing this. The enemy will try to enslave you by using various methods. He wants to make a chosen one out of you that will lead his legions to war. If he succeeds, with his cunning and your strength, our worlds will be lost forever. Not one 
Let's hook you up, Achilles. Even if you know that you're going straight into the mouth of fear. <laughs> Until I tear apart your flesh, you monster, my story continues on. <laughs> You're calling me a monster? But have you ever seen me kill anyone? You, on the other hand, know only how to kill. Just think about how many sons you've taken from their mothers. How many brothers and sisters you orphaned. You were so focused on getting me, that you didn't take a look at your own reflection. You're a worm preying on others' fears, but your short life is coming to an end now. You threatened me with death under my own roof. Soon you'll know a fate worse than death. I can promise you that. Supposedly, hope springs eternal, when it seemed that Phobos would prevail and forever enshroud Greece in a veil of fear. Against him stood he, the bravest of Myrmidons, Achilles. He made peace with the past and accepted his weaknesses. After all, he was only human. With cold iron in hand and the flame of courage in his heart, he descended into Phobos' lair and defeated him. But was it for good? Agamemnon was right about one thing. Fear is eternal. It will always find a way to crawl into our hearts and poison them with doubt. 
make our goals unattainable and our fights doomed to fail. Achilles managed to tame his weaknesses. Despite doubt, he found the strength to act. He was supported by his new friends at each stage of his journey. The trust and help of his companions tipped the scales. Greece was saved and the wounds covering it will heal over time. There was only one matter left. The world of the living was no longer a place for Achilles. Hades, the Lord of the Dead, will come back for him once he repairs the damage done to his kingdom. Achilles accepted his destiny. However, his legend will inspire future generations. Sound, Achilles. I'm glad things in Greece are finally getting back to normal. Speaking of normal, I see that you came to like your divine appearance. <laughs> Why not? The world has gone mad, so I allowed myself a bit of madness, too. <laughs> Besides, now I look kind of more alive, don't you think? I decided to stay with you a little longer. Curtis is still learning, and I couldn't leave him alone with all this mess after a faux boss. I expected the lad would lose his memory, but he doesn't remember me at all. Hades mentioned that staying in the underworld affects everyone a bit differently. On the other hand, the lad has been through a lot. I think he'll be better off that way. <sighs> There's a lot of work ahead of me, but I will always find time for an old friend. If you need my help, you can count on me. And you don't have to go as far as blackmail at all. Thanks for everything. I wouldn't have defeated Phobos without your help. Ah, nonsense. I'm sure you'd go fight him even with your bare fists if you had no other choice. Have a safe journey, Achilles. Maybe you know me better than I know myself. Take care. I knew you could make it, Achilles. Without your help, Ithia, I would be wandering around in the dark, 
I only pointed you to the door, but you went through it yourself. You deserve thanks from all of us. So, this is the end. The end of the sick ambitions of Phobos, that's for sure. There's still a lot of toil and worry ahead for the citizens of Greece before peace can reign here. What are you planning to do now? People still need support. The roads are full of wild beasts and bandits, and Phobos servants are pointlessly wandering like restless apparitions. I'll restore the temple to its old glory, and later, I'll probably keep on helping others understand the world around them. I won't forget what you did for this realm, Achilles. I'll ensure that your legend endures. May luck never leave you. And you too, Pythia. Wherever you go.
If things had worked out differently for me, I could even see you among my units, right? Father sent me to rescue you. Are you alright? Yes, I, I guess so. I already thought they got him and I wouldn't see him ever again. Seems that it's safe here now. Find shelter in a safe place and I'll send him to you shortly. Alright, sir. Your son is safe and sound. Join him and run away from here. Greece is no longer a safe place. Thank you for everything, stranger. Yes, we'll do that. Please, take this as a token of my gratitude.
At least I could do this much for you. Hopefully you can find your peace now. Won't find anyone alive in here. I need to go to Yanti and tell her what I discovered. Where did she go? She couldn't have gone too far. Maybe she left some tracks. Well, well, well. Who do we have here? There you are. I told you to wait for me. It's not safe here. I'm sorry, but I had to go back. I'm not allowed to wander away from home. Yanti, I found your brothers. They're dead. Dead? How? How did that happen? The cave you went into was inhabited by monsters. You must have woken them up. I, I felt that something was wrong, but I didn't lose hope. Now, I know that I'm alone with him. Who do you mean? One day, he came to our house and didn't leave. He was looking for my brothers, but he found only me there, between the columns. I see his glowing eyes. I hear his whispers. He won't let me go. He wants me to join the others. I'll check it right away. Just don't go anywhere. <laughs> 